Consider the random process of flipping two coins. You flip one coin which lands on either heads or tails, and then you flip another coin which lands on either heads or tails. Write down the sample space of this random process. The sample space of a random process is merely the listing of all possible outcomes of that random process. In this case, we can get two heads, we can get tails heads, or we can get uh, heads tails, or we can get two tails. So these four outcomes is the sample space of flipping two coins. Let's now define a random variable x that is the number of tails that results from this random process. So it's a mapping between the random process and some numerical values. Let's write down the probability distribution of this random variable. Probability distribution of a random variable is merely the listing of all the possible values that this random variable can take on and the probabilities that each of these values occurs. So in our case, the random variable can take on value 0 when we get heads heads, or it can take value 1, or it can take value 2. Now the probability of getting 0 is a 1 out of 4, that's when we get heads heads. The probability of getting just one tail is 2 out of 4 when we get tails heads or heads tails. So 2 out of 4, that's a 1 half. Or it could be 2 when we get tails tails, which happens in 1 out of 4 cases. When we add all the probabilities across all the possible values, they add up to 1. And so the probability distribution tells us how the probabilities are distributed across all the different outcomes.